Okay, we are finished with the deck. Let's take a look from a few different angles. This is the Evergreen deck that we started about a month ago. Showed you some videos of it earlier. See how it ended up. We have the lights in place. The railings turned out really nice. Their pool that they've since put up. The hot tub pad that we poured and then built the deck around the hot tub. Lots of great storage areas, areas for seating. Square foot wise, this is actually one of the two largest decks that we've built. I always recommend customers to go with larger than smaller. I've never had a customer tell me that their deck or their patio was too large, but I certainly have had my fair share tell me that they wish they would have gone larger. Here it is from the back corner. Turned out really, really nice. You can see all the boards with the invisible screws. I'll take a look at the skirting that we used. We have the deck lights in just for the steps. Skirting going along this side. Actually, we went with skirting all the way around. This is the electrical work that we put in. Put in new electrical for the hot tub, for the pool, for the lights. Got it kind of hidden out here on the side. Boy, this is so nice. They're going to enjoy this for many years to come. Right here where I'm walking is where we're going to be doing the gunite swimming pool for them. And up this side. This is the area where we're going to be doing the gunite swimming pool. And then as you might remember from an earlier video, the area over this deck is where we're going to be building an outdoor pavilion which we already have the piers formed and poured and marked underneath the deck so that we can set the anchor posts when they're ready for that phase. They are so very pleased with this project and so am I. Turned out beautiful. Okay, that's it for now.